Hello viewers and welcome to a new episode of your program when I talk to the camera with me Kona Sisi. Right across Sierra Leone, not on news for say President Bio, they clock four years in office. For that very reason, they, today we they talk to people them for men and Giri, their own views concerning President Bio in government. What you get for say about development where happen at Salon during President Bio in government? Let we listen to them people here so as they share with me their own views in regards to this particular topic here so. Hello and welcome to this interview. Mina Kona Sisi from Sierra Network Press. Please introduce yourself. Um, good day, our listeners and viewers. I'm Abubakar Siddiq Dorami, the uh, Publicity Secretary for the APC Western Region. Alright. Um, as President Bio the clock, fourth year in office, come April 4, from an opposing party point of view, tell me about what you get to say about the development aspects we President Bio in new um, direction platform can with. Well, I'm generally I'm part of the opposition uh, party, but I think I'm generally um, I go give my own views on the views of people, because I interact with people them all over the country and for know exactly what in the issues them. I think say one thing what the people them they ask for first, now nah, just for see that their life they improve economically and um, morally. But um, four years now down the road, we see the SLPP manifesto was beautifully written. But um, we see a lot of problems I mean, there. First of all, I will start up with uh, fisheries, of which the president and his speech in a parliament talks, he therefore increased the revenue from the fishing sector. I think it was from $74 million to something of over $200 million. And the first person we make that statement in Abin Paminda Bra, we have been the World Bank country representative in Salon. But we see within um, the past four years, nine major fishing companies are in this country. We see six all left this country. Also, they left just because of higher taxes and unfair treatment and all other things. Um, then they don't cost a lot of unemployment. They don't cost revenue the generation to the government. And then companies also not left go far. And they within the sub-region of um, West Africa. So that now one come down to the um, agricultural sector. Me, not possibly understand a lot about agriculture. You know, agriculture is very, very dynamic, and you get forget people that we understand which you mean for make you be able to get investment in agriculture. We see that um, President Bill means we will stop for and go push, and we will stop for import rest in the country. We may understand that the mechanics that we may put in place was completely wrong. First of all, they may get an investment with the private sector and Amiata conference all in 2018, of which up to now, not see any investor don't put money for plants, even one flower port rest. And at the end of the day, we should say the president under the government and bring a lot of tractors and machines to them in country. We then commence the plantation in 2019 at Tomabum, which is a 54,000 thousand hectares piece of land and up to now we not see any um, yield in investment we not see anything so it's another failed project coming out to the electricity we are in um, the electricity Indian country we may get um first of all in freetown we may get two major suppliers of the electricity when uh i mean edsa mean not on bundle i mean np don't bundle to edsa and egtc so for EGTC then they deal with the generation we are in um, them and they do um, the supply from the King Tom power station where they get about 36 megahertz of electricity and Black Hole Road they get about 15 megahertz electricity. Then you may get uh, the um, ADAX, we're now in a Sunbad, a new company. We then save me to get about uh, 15 or to 16 megahertz. We put all land together, it's 70 something megahertz of electricity. We go supply the city and other places. We see there was a project in the way, I mean, for build Bumbuna Phase 2, and I mean, 300 megahertz electricity. We doubt 300 me megahertz electricity because some disturbance been get for the, the past government, we bring come the car power ship with APC not ever use. APC not ever connect them, but it was a contract for made and day for one year. Whilst Bumbuna Phase 2, they kick up, and um, then we go, can do away with the car power ship. So now been the arrangement that, but APC never used the car power ship because it's not been done by then. But we see the government, this new government coming, President Bill and they come with real investors, then cancel the contract and everything with the King Tom Power Station when a 36 megahertz machine, then cancel the one with uh, Black Hole Road Agreco when I've been about 15 to 16 megahertz, and even somebody's not been supported through the plantation uh, now nah, um, Magburka when at the. Uh, the Magba sugar cane plantation because we they make sure that then trading with sunbad for me they use for burn for fire the turbines them up. We see all them things and they don't go down. When all them things and they don't go down and the government come in and stop um, EGTC for use black already and King Tom. 
We people are going redundant. TGTs is going important. They know they supply no electricity, not even one small Kaba Tiger generator, not they. So, which in the result, too, they're going to the car power ship, of which the presidential spokesman, I go quote him, Yusuf Kokotoma Sandy, me say, they don't do a very good job. They negotiate with the car power ship. They deal with the car power ship better pass the one way they may get with APC. Fine. Me take him so. But how come she could not go negotiate a better deal with less than waiting it was? And now electricity tariff don't become three times higher than what it was before. So can you come back to the people and tell them that you're lying? Or can you come back to the people and tell them exactly waiting you not tell them where we, we, we you know? So how could that happen? So um, we see that I'm um, giving the car power ship. I, I like for talk about this. Because um, the car power ship, now import you import electricity. You they provide job for the Turkish people. You they send the money to the Turkish government or the Turkish businessman. And when you they pay, you they pay with dollar. And the dollar we they pay with, you they put more pressure on your economy and the foreign exchange in your country. So at the end of the day, all that money they go, we people with the EGTC, we work in NP and we in a Falcon Bridge. Government they pay there every month, month in, month out for nothing, for doing nothing. At the end of the day, we they import light in this country. At the end of the day, the counts as we import on the balance of trade deficit, we make we get a weaker economy. When I make right now, we suffer blackout, so, and we get all this problem. Last year, again, the same problem in kicking. They say, nah, make them get for make the machines, and say, nah, payment to the machines, we don't know. Let them address all we want. We mean to get light before. Let them make sure they provide light for we. We do not want any literature. If they're able to make them better, let them make them Lady, the IMD, and we they talk about the West African power pool with people in the jump for West African power pool with the Bumbuna phase two. If we supply, if we get Bumbuna phase two, we they sell electricity rainy season to the other African countries, and we get that foreign exchange. Then at the end of the day, when dry season come, we able to supply ourselves electricity. If we need more, we buy from the one in the so at the end of the day, not to we money no more, they go to them. They save your money, they come to it. But when they cancel the Bumbuna phase two project. So now with the West African power pool of people and the jump for now, buy with the buy electricity. We go get for the buy electricity. They import them from other countries. And at the end of the day, we think get for Apple. We get a weaker economy and we foreign in exchange and may come through the door. Now we see Usai as uh, the president in four years they come. Wait till we don't be faced with now uh, um, fuel crisis and fuel problems. Me, most of my vehicles they are using are diesel vehicles. Now I can't use and uh, unable to use me diesel motor car them because diesel not in country. And we see they make a um, statement saying that uh, because of the war with Ukraine and Russia, make the fuel price go up. That is so true. Nobody may question that. Because in the fight and Russia are the third most oil producing nation of the world, definitely uh, the price, because we didn't get, don't sanction them, then supply may come into prices and go up. Factors of demand and supply, nobody can question that. But on the other hand, when fuel go $104 a barrel in the, in the stock market, Nine governments raised petrol to 12,000 leons in a salon. In 2014, 2015, fuel go to $107 a barrel in a salon. I mean, at the world, fuel in a salon have been 6,000. What's the difference? So, me the advice the president, let go back. Talk to the people who are in a petroleum regulation agency before. Talk to the people who are in a ministry of trade. Let them come and show you the pricing formula. Because something they were hiding inside that pricing formula, where people they know, we make the prices and go up. If they, I mean, they sell them, now the stock market at that time, $107, and sell fuel for 6,000 leons. Now we're now $104, they raise them to 12,000 leons. Fuel go to $118 now, so they raise the fuel price go to 15,000 leons. In 2008, 2009, People can do their research. Fuel go to the highest, $145 a barrel. Fuel was 3,750 3, leons in country, Nas alone. And we see other countries in Guinea with the next door. From where Alpha Conde did our government. Te Colonel Mamadi Dumbuya don't come. Fuel now still 10,000 day in no move stitch. Other countries around the sub region, Gambia and other places, and fuel still day the same way because what in government can do in them cases in the the things that we government get into them particular pricing formula say they get environmental charges and get um, road maintenance fund and get echo tax and get then get for look at demorage and get for look at storage all in the government they take all them things and they out and reduce them tax and drop them tax so that the people and the body will be taken away from the people because you know see this russia and ukraine thing is just temporal when it don't when feel good on then you can kick them back in and start for running because i um, feel like composite uh, product once you allow fuel for go up, you want for the fuel be one dollar ten cent. Fuel will never be one dollar ten cent for a long time. It's just a short term, because once you move them to one dollar ten cent, like if fuel go twelve thousand, we see the dollar move from one one million one hundred. It don't go to one million two hundred and fifty now in the market or so. Once and don't move the dollar again to the fuel to fifteen thousand, we see the fuel. We see the dollar again get for chase. I mean, very short time within the next two three months, I will tell you, see fuel. I mean, dollar price go go to one million five hundred, because. 
when you raise fuel up, transport they go up, press they go up, gari, sugar, milk, water, ogre, everything they go up. And once they go up, the factors demand and supply. If they move with everything, cement, stress, everything they go up. And now dollar then they take for buying most of them things in the and once it go up, the the, the, the dollar save they, they they move up and your currency they devalue. So at the end of the day, you they come back to say you go find out say the one thousand five the uh, fifteen thousand loans juxtaposed to a dollar go what something like 90 cent again so you don't have any choice now for moving back so i think say um, with president bill there's a lot much more to do even with education we are here about free quality education the name is so beautiful and all but what is the quality in the education the only thing we see the school picking and gets now second now primary school and secondary school now free school fee program that's how we call it the teachers are not being trained the facilities for the teachers are not there the schools are not are not being improved President Biomi promised in the first two years, no school, no day we go get afternoon shift. Up till now, all the school they will get afternoon shift, they still get afternoon shift. You know, change. We not see the construction of any classrooms in the school. The traditional schools they also have been as alone. Now, Freetown, the high school, the Amadia, the Annie Walsh, the uh, the girls' high school, the Prince of Wales, they get afternoon shift up till now. So if they want indeed they suffer from that, the one then are the villages, I wonder which thing they go, they go through. So some other things here, so we have a look at them. And we see the free quality education and give the beginning book one year. After that, nothing will happen again. Other things to them promise them not to happen again. We see university fees them. University fees them don't go up than what they were before. We see even from where um, they make the statement, say, admission fee, uh, admission, um, um, everything will be free. They're not for pay for them. But the picking and still they pay for them up to today. And this is a statement that the president make, and presidential spokesman make, and the minister of um, information make them. So come on, wait till me, they say, let me stop, let me be realistic. In politics, what you able to do? Let me tell the people. What you able to do? Let me stop for the fake the people and tell the people what you can do. So the entire SLPB manifesto. If you look at them, all the things they would propose that then go make sure in the free quality education, each district they get one library. If chief, each chief dom they get a laboratory and all non no new library may not see them build. No laboratory may not see na any uh, any uh, chief dom. And they say they go build center of excellence now every district. I'm still waiting to see that. All the things they know happen. So all these are the packages of the free quality education. So if me they rate the, rate the free, free quality education, trust me, um, being moderate and being nice, I think I'll get a nine percent. Okay. Um, as you don't talk a lot about the education, the economy, and also um, uh, um, you don't you don't you don't talk about fuel crisis na 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 salon presently. Let me talk about the justice system na salon. I mean, inside the New Direction Manifesto, we see na part 5, page 63 of Amway, um, they reprimand the APC government then for, say, na a condemned uh, judicial system because um, it gets too much interference from the executive arm of government as the state say na others from above. The people no, 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 no get too much belief in the, judici in the judiciary anymore. So, um, Presently, how you go rate the new direction government judiciary? I think you're talking about the judiciary. I mean, I'm one of the best person for talks about the judiciary. Because um, during this judiciary uh, system or this judicial era where they're under these uh, new directions, um, they formulate a case against me where the witnesses and the case from lower court, none of them not call me name. Everybody and um, all the, 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 the police findings, nobody not called me name Panda case. But yet still the judiciary allow and put me in prison and make her take eleven months, two weeks na Pademba Road. So I think say me na the epitome or me na the symbol of judicial um, judicial mishap and um, judicial incompetence in this country. At the end of the day, they therefore put the case, they put on a magistrate, uh, magistrate court. None of the witnesses not called me name on the case, me and Abba Judge Williams and anything. Then can we go again a high court? None of the witnesses not called me name. At the end of the day, and suffer away for 11 months, two weeks, Now Padamba Road, at the end of the day, they therefore discharge the case. No case was not there. Um, you see, when people can talk about the judicial, you know, I mean, let's talk about that case day. During that uh, negligence or incompetence, with the problem we happened at Padamba Road April 29th, that was in uh, 2020, where people had died, I was there. There was a possibility or tendency for, let me say, me for lost my life day. But just because of the blessings of God and other things, and definitely God decided to keep me alive. You know, when they talk about the judiciary, they talk about the system. But I will tell you, there are some magistrates and some judges. Then we deal now the judiciary. We're very, very good. We get so much respect for. I will not name names here for make I not get um, some people um, 
into trouble, maybe with them boss or other people them. Forget about I'm not a tribalist, I'm not a mean look at anything. But you get people them we are owe so much respect to because um, ever since what happened to me, I begin to follow the judiciary closely. I begin to follow a lot of other things. I begin to follow plenty of things. Um. Look at the case of Mohammed Kamarimba Mansari. Mohammed Kamarimba Mansari they accuse him for for uh, sexual uh, sexual penetration or stuff like that because that's not rape. I want the people to understand see, rape different from sexual penetration and all or sexual violence. Mohammed Kamarimba don't they under now going to three years now. Nothing you know, happened with Mama Kamarimba. They don't give him bail. A bail condition we all know say for me. If Mama Kamarimba say an officer in Usmi born, the police can get a report of that for God and heaven's sake. Usa will get a proper judicial system. Then they subpoena the uh, the inspector general of police for coming and give testimony on that. And at the end of the day, they release him. But up to now, they don't give him a bail. Six months now, they don't they go into the prisons. Make you go see. I spent 11 months in Pademba Road. People and they wait in the hole for frequenting. The first time here, they say there's a charge for frequenting. If they pass pass up and down a street, some more police they hold you. Then they lock some them but then they for three, four years. Yes. No, they get frequenting. Then they hold them for frequenting. Then they are one. Then they hold them for loitering. Then loitering different from fre frequenting. You know, people and they drivers and they will cut the riders and they wait in the old na street for simple traffic offense. Then they did three, four years in a Pademba Road prisons. People case them way. Available offense, then they keep people and then they're on trial for four five years now. Palembo Road Prison. I know somebody we they mean arrest now, they mean arrest them for unlawful possession of arms. Where well, the maximum charge for that case in a six months that person they in trial take five years, four months till they be in Palembo Road. At the end of the day, they find them guilty now. Six months jail for do that man they spend and that person they spend an extra four year, ten months behind Palembo Road behind bars for doing nothing. I know somebody where then they they. Then pulling case in a magistrate court and committing case to high court. It didn't say Palembo Road for four years in you know, go court. I know the names. I know a lot of prob problems. Mm -hmm. Cases in day way they're supposed to give bill. They're not a give bill. Go to the court system. Let's see. You see judge and they tell you see this court and me court. Case in the way they accuse people for murder. Please, you're not going to court. So now prove me wrong. When they accuse people for murder, people in the go court and not get no compliment, no complainant, they not get no witness. I see in the go court and they are joined. And sometimes some man they go court three months, four months, and not even see in judge. Now court cell they left. The clerk give the adjournment and put them black and black, black Maria. Then kill them go by them road. So the injustice really happen. A plenty. And um, you know, uh, in the in the judiciary, I not feel say we need an overhaul. I think say we need for put the board down and get a new system back because um, the advantage plenty. And some of them things are so now the recommendations them, and the things that will lead we to the war, the, the, the civil war we did into. So I think say I think say we we not for even go down the road then though for try follow correct them. All right. So finally, waiting go be the message where you the left out there for President be obit that you don't talk about a lot of things where you feel say in need for send attention to when you get for the development. First thing I will say to President Bill, you know, this is one thing that I always say. President Bill, I'm a very, very lucky man. I will say now one of the most luckiest Sierra Leonean way you go ever see. Because out of we seven million in this country, that man they become vice president in this country. God choose I become vice president. God choose I become president then, nineteen ninety six. He left. Out of with seven million, we the line long. We want to press your book. God choose again, he can't press in 2018. So God gave them opportunities here. So I think, say, if we don't be the most prolific president, who will forget the most accepted and um, tolerant president. But if we come back, we can see human rights violations. We can see economy, you know, get a system where we hold the economy. We can see inflation don't go up by. I mean, inflation don't go up in the country almost hundred percent. We see goods and services just the skyrocket. You able for hold them to the balance. I think it's a pity. So always, you know, they ask. It's never too late for turn around. But definitely, elections is next year and um, June twenty fourth. We ask people for go register for let them go register. September third registration they start. We now are not telling anybody who's for go vote. Just go go register. When the time comes, you go make up your mind who that you go go vote for. But that one day now you write. We know all the people and sit on the grumble about government. We you not been go vote and make help for make your own decision. So they ask people for go vote and press them. You are they tell and say elections day next year. I don't know what you get for doing all the waiting get for being campaign message or whatnot. But um, yet still I'm still waiting to for make a waiting get for be the campaign message. But the things so we don't go down on the education, on the economy, on the justice sector and the educational sector, I think it's a pity. I know now I go get for turn them around, but the people will get for voting and go get for votes their will and their wish. And one child ask people and for do please, we don't want any violence, we don't want any fet fet. We ask the police, let them be moderate. 
for go arrest people them and this that intimidation they know they push or make people in fear or people in afraid. Let me make sure see we all this country because this is the one green country we we'll get some of we don't get no side for go and we need to go no side but Lord put we hand together this country let we push and go before let we get a better Sierra Leone for we the Pekin they come after we and generations yet unborn. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay, Colonel um, Arthur Pierce and um, Mina, the Acting Western Regional Chairman for NGC. So I'm uh, glad you for the NSA Network for the very first time. All right. Um, as President, be the clock four years come April 4th. From an opposition party standing point, give you your observations so far in regards to development in different sectors in the southern. Well, um, in the first place, President Bill don't try his best. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If I say he's not trying best, I go lie. But it's also true that his best is not enough. You understand? So what he able to do, now he don't do so. You know, and um, it is very clear that he's not able to pass what he do so because this is now first time. And, um, you know, now this first time before we don't see all in strength. So if in strength in in first time, not enough for the people of Sierra Leone. So, you know, they expect much in the second time. But also, um, before I talk about the things that we we so disappointed over, let's talk about waiting with me and we NGC party feel say so don't do a good. We basically um, it don't increase access to the school building. We not call them free quality education. I call them access to the school building. What do you mean? But who picking them now? They go inside school building with the intention then they go learn, but then they come on back. Empty. So the access to the school building is a good thing, and the access you don't create. And um, the bad them boku. Hmm? You go see, of course, a few days ago I just come and say I did. We invite we all. Then then the arrest, then is bright and CDI at Tunis and plenty other. Femi Claudio School. Then you know good for we politics, we democracy, human rights, etc., etc. And then they create a lot of political instability where they make the country people if you say not safe and you're not good for investment, you're not good for nobody. We move to the economy. Of course, I've been a very good um, research, um, resourceful individual where they provide qualitative and quantitative data to the party of NGC on the things that really happen. For example, what they call the bread and butter issues, eh? Almost for breast, almost for pamine, almost for pepper. According to we last research, now being 68,000 loans for a family of four, mama, papa, and two picking for able for manage for cook small food when I want them back, you go eat them. Then I've been earlier on this year, and we don't see the increment in the price of fuel, the increment in the dollar. Somebody just told me it's mentioned at 13,500 black market for dollar. So you come all day, you go to energy. We all know the light not day. You come all day, you go to water, water not day. You come all day, you go to, um, you know, what, what should I call it? You go to like um, systems in this country. It is difficult. For example, I don't pay for me motor driver's license. I don't pay for uh, me the renewal of my driver's license. Teti didn't say license not day. System shut down. My vehicle law expired the 22nd of this month. My vehicle license do expire. 30 days, say vehicle license not day. Somebody complains, say passport safe not day. So the institutions, them, they're under problem. We don't talk about the independence of the state, state institution, the police, the media, not for talk. We know what we go through with the media. Thank God for, like, on and now where they come up for give the people the information privately and independently. You go to the judiciary, question day, the people not get confidence. You go to NEC, people not get confidence. And EU, international organization, they say don't confirm, wait in the opposition, they talk. So we tell talk not to about that, eh? not to about that, not the reality of exactly what is happening. Emma Sin talk about in music, Coconut Head. He said, you cannot give what you don't have if you are not, you are not. So for me, uh, in a summary, uh, you not do well, it's, you not do well, and uh, Going into the election year in period, I see desperation power, man, for do more because they want for go second term. We see they travel, travel, we see they go to try for sign contracts for rest in Vietnam. But one go ask the question, what happened to Thomas Bom? We plant immediately after we come into governor. So we see the same things and I'm sure they cannot continue to leave this country 
Usa uh, one for Siam, so I think it's a poor performance for me. All right. As you don't say, you don't agree with what your opposing parties and don't they say. Um, when you look at um, the playing ground, the level playing ground for opposing political parties for come up and 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 speak up for these issues where you don't mention. So you think say freedom of speech don't 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 really there over the, f the, the the couple of years. Well, uh, in the first place, I think in my earlier statement, I tell you, say we just come as CID, Criminal Investigation Department, Padamba Road, and um, that is because they see opposition party speaking to members of the public, then call me for for interrogation and call me then detain with chairman and leader and all of that. I was asked to produce evidence and videos and pictures to show that. These people are not thugs. Of course, the video is all over, all over on social media. We don't see another term where we particularly position on the census, the uh, most controversial census of this country ever. Then call with your man back with CID. In so many other parts, of, we see CD. I don't mention plenty of other people are talking, they arrest them. Mm. So we know, say, freedom of, freedom of speech, if people like say, they boy, not they. Because then they use them for score international accolades, but in the real sense, it's not applicable. We know the same. Right. One thing where we really draw people their attention we um the new direction manifesto become what's now that um the part five talk ab get a part where you talk about say um the aspect of corruption not just get for be a governance issue but a national threat. So so far, four years down the lane, what you get for say in regards to that day? Well corruption <laughs> I remember this word where the chief minister been say say egregious. I've been big English, and I've been what it means if I had to go to my Google and dictionary for land. You know, hmm, that particular word they the try to tell you the kind way how then say the previous government been so corrupt, the length at which the corruption been so big, the kind way we exaggerate the corruption. So to me, to you, we expect much. When we see some moves they wouldn't begin to make with single treasury accounts, setting up of the commissions of inquiry, some of us were hopeful that, oh, Papa, go thank you, better go can can now. At least we could see a drastic drop in corruption. But what we can see, the Arata big past the push. I know if you remember the statements where Dr. Dennis Bright be make on 98.1. What did that mean? The very first test case for the anti-corruption commission, I know one for talk about the outcomes of the of the COI. All man know say in a, in a, in a, in a selective justice. All man know how the team pass, and the amount of money we government spend, we not see the result. Not in our one side. Let us go to fighting corruption real time, because the COI be mainly focused on the previous government. So let us pay attention now to the, the this government. Then we defeat corruption. There was a case of 50,000 bags of rice, the very first of kind of the public attention. We, they even sacked the minister by then, it was Alpha Timbo, Minister of Basic and, uh, Education. They sacked plenty of other big men in our government. Tangibles, rest, eh? bag rest. Eh? We, if then thief and then go search for and then go see her. Boss, you know, go with 50,000 bags of rice inside one month, self. two months, three months. Self. We not see the rest then, today. Day. And um, then they, and many other, we look at the audit reports where they come out every year, billions of billions, they win a cash loss. You know, the African Express, they do a very big and a powerful job. Me, I'm not being convinced until a point earlier where the reports begin. Well, I see me, you're fumbling, name the inside. Now I call her, I say, hey, I see, I see you named the old. And I say, yes, now so, but not to say, but inside, can give me some excuses. To show you how detailed and how trustworthy that particular information on corruption, where they provide free quality information for the Anti-Corruption Commission for take, for fight real corruption, but we'll not see nothing. Uh, where they see, say, anti-corruption, they say, hey, ACC don't catch some man, they don't arrest some man. We don't even see names when at this government, but when at the previous government, we they see names, we they see them, they take them to court. We know what's in the happen. So in, in, in summary, as I tell you, now the Arata don't be past the push. The way we suppose for catch the Arata when the push. The Arata don't become so big, don't embolden, and the push them will catch again. So situation are topsy-turvy.
So um, come 2023, we'll see who's how we go for next election. So beat that now, the final year for President Bill in this in time. What thing will be your message where you left for him? Well, President Bill, as we round up, and um, like I said, we appreciate you for all which you don't do because, however, you don't try your own way. You don't develop some people in life. Even though the margin is small, uh, we would expect past this. But we just want to tell and say thank you, Nana Wan. And as we look forward to the rebirth of politics in Sierra Leone, we are hopeful for a new government. And a government we basically could do better pass with it in don't do because as it is now, things are not easy. Mm. One packet water now seven now five hundred loans for one. It's off. All right. Plenty thank you to you. Thank you very much for having me. In regards to education, when it gets to do with health, business in a salon, NIJ, corruption and so on. People don't talk about what you need to get for say when you get for do with development issues and then different sectors they are so in a salon. And don't send message to President Bill as to how they want for see salon talent during in last year in government. Member say me will bring you the program can today. My name is Kona Sisei. So today we meet back to a new episode of the program Talk to the Camera. They say tata. -ta.